Hello everyone and welcome back to Nerdy Couch. I'm here with my co-pilot, Jarvis. How you doing, Jarvis? Hey, hey, how you doing? Got a couple of uh, comic books to show you. Um, not too much, it's been a slow week in the comic book world for me. Uh, and I'm trying to save money so I'm on a pretty tight budget. But we're gonna show a couple books, right bud? First, we're gonna show this. It's I don't consider it a comic book. What do you think of that, buddy? You like that? We have The Amazing Spider-Man. Where are you going? You're supposed to be my co-pilot. Uh, I guess I'm doing this alone, guys. So, we have The Amazing Spider-Man, Spider-Man Secrets. Uh, like I said, I don't know if I consider this a comic or not, uh, but my girlfriend got it for me recently, so I thought I'd show it off. Um, it's more of a novel. It says that it's supposed to be retro style, number one. Um, and it says, old school look, all new action. So don't know whether it's supposed to be telling an old story or or not. But it's definitely meant to look kind of old schoolish. Um, I have never seen a book with this thick of a cover before. Uh, that's absolutely crazy. It's, it's a huge hunk of cardboard. And the art style inside of it is pretty cool as well. So I will read that very shortly. Uh, and I think I'll enjoy it. Uh, so on to some real comic books. The next one here is kind of a big deal. Um, you'll get it in a moment. It's big from the movie Big. Um, I love that uh, old Tom Hanks movie and you know I've never seen this book before so thought I'd pick it up. Uh, all these books are uh, dollar bin dives so I didn't pay much for them. Uh, I never do. Next we have Ragman number two. Um, I really like Ragman. Uh, he's one of the DC characters that I really enjoy. Um, it's a little bit beat up, a little wavy, but uh, for a buck I'm happy with it and I get to read about a character that I enjoy. Keeping on with some DC books, I have Mr. Miracle number one. Um, I've heard some about this character but I don't know too much so I would like to know more. Hence the reason I picked this book up. And it's a number one, so a number one for a dollar in my books, that's a great deal. I also have Mr. Miracle number two for a dollar. And again, great pickup for me. Next book on the list today is a great looking cover. It's Web of Venom, Carnage Reborn. That's a Donny Cates book and I am crazy about Donny Cates' book. I, he's one of my favorite writers, and any day of the week I'll pick this book up for a buck. I may even have it already, but I am happy to have a second copy if that's the case. Next, I've been trying to collect the Moon Knight series, so I picked a couple of them up, and for, again, very cheap. This is Mark Spector's Moon Knight number three. Um, I don't think that's the same series uh, as the last couple books I've shown, but I'm trying to build a Moon Knight collection. I uh, just started it, so any Moon Knight book for me is a win. Um, next one, and the very last one, is Moon Knight number 7. Now that is part of the series, I believe, uh, that I'm collecting, so I'm very happy to have this one. Um, I'm trying to get 1 to 10 and then move on from there and uh, it's looking pretty good so far. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I know this was a short video, but I've got more to come. We've got another Venom video where we are reviewing number three in Donny Kate's Venom series with me and my buddy Chris Mike, uh, and plenty more to come. So please like and subscribe, and also check out my Instagram at nerdycouch at Instagram. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Peace!